Use wireless internet installation. Choose a location. This device uses the AT&T cellular network. Locate the device where you have a strong signal from a cellular tower, typically near a window or outside wall. It also should be located in the general area where you will be using your home phone, computer, or general Wi-Fi capable devices. It can be plugged into an outlet or run off of a battery. Insert SIM. The device comes pre-installed with a nano SIM card. When a SIM is not installed in the device, the signal strength light will blink red. With the back plate and battery removed, slide the nano SIM card into the SIM slot with the gold contacts facing down and the notch to the bottom right. Insert battery. To insert the battery, line up the gold contacts on the bottom left and gently press down until the battery clicks into place. Reattach the back plate by sliding it into place. Power the device on or off. Use the power switch on the back of the device to turn the device on or off. The power light will blink green if it is running off of battery power and will be a steady green light if the device is plugged in. Check wireless signal. The signal strength light will turn on once the device has connected to the AT&T cellular network. When the device has a strong LTE signal cellular connection, the signal strength light will be a steady green with one to four bars. When the device has a strong 3G or 4G signal cellular connection, the signal strength light will be a steady blue with one to four bars and may be sufficient. Signal strength may vary in different parts of your home. You can move your AT&T wireless internet device to find the best cellular connection location. Thank you.